Jason, I'm outside McHale Center where Rondé Hollis Jefferson never lost a home game. I spoke exclusively with him after making the big announcement. First, what did Coach Miller tell you when you were deciding? Um, you know, he was, he was you know, um, excited and he was emotional at the same time, you know, because he, he knows what I wanted to accomplish and what I wanted to do. And it was just, he also wanted me to stay. So, you know, um, he told me at the end of the day, you got to do what's best for you and your family. What will you miss most about being an Arizona Wildcat? Um, I'll, I'll miss, you know, the, the, the fans. Uh, they're great. They're amazing. Um, I'll miss the, the brotherhood that we have here, you know, from the coaching staff on down to the players. Coach Miller said he'd never seen you so serious. Why is that? Um, you know, I, I would say that was the time for me, you know, to be serious. You know, it's a serious step in my life. It's a big step in my life. And um, it was definitely needed, you know, um, for me to, you know, like kind of be that way as far as a business mindset. As a young kid, was the NBA always the end dream, the, the long goal for you? Uh, as a kid, I don't think I was good enough. <laughs> <laughs> if you could just, you know, have one final message to the Wildcat fans, to everyone who supported you, what would you tell them? Um, I would tell them, you know, thank you, you know, for everything that, you know, you have done for me, you know, cheering, being there for us, you know, even when, you know, things got rough, you know, you always seem to care. And uh, we really appreciate that, you know, from the bottom of our heart. Our hearts, my heart, and you know, our, our staff members. Thank you. Well, Sean Miller said that his team typically huddles 1,200 times a season before and after practice. And he said Rondé Hollis Jefferson led every single one of them. I'm Ashley Brewer, Kega 9, on your side.